The following screencast will provide a demonstration of the Acknowledge Respiratory Sinus Arrhythmia Analysis Module. This particular method is based on a, a time domain method which was published by Grossman et al. in Psychophysiology. And basically it uses a recorded lead to ECG waveform which we have here in the top channel and also a respiration signal. This was recorded using a Biopac TSD201 respiration transducer. And essentially what the analysis will do it will one, run through and identify the artois interval values and create a new channel for that and then it will identify the inspiration and expiration points before conducting the RSA analysis. This particular analysis is found in the hemodynamics menu and it's labeled respiratory sinus arrhythmia. The software asks you or prompts you for the ECG channel, in this case it's channel 1. Okay, so the software has now gone through and identified the ECG. Now we're asked to identify the respiration channel. Okay, perfect. I'm going to close this out. We'll take a closer look at the data so we can see what the software has done. Now each of these, this is the respiration signal, the nose with the arrow is marking the beginning of an inspiration and the downward arrow coming out of the nose is marking an expiration. So you can see each of these points is marked in the recording and that's important for this particular analysis because during the inspiration cycle we're going to look for the minimum R to R interval and then during the expiration cycle we're actually going to be looking for the maximum R to R interval and this is displayed, if I auto scale this, this is our R to R interval and this is in milliseconds and this was this channel was calculated based on our our ECG analysis. If we zoom in a little further, we'll see our ECG waveform has been completely analyzed. If we come back to our spreadsheet, if I spread this out a little bit, get a better view. Now we, in the preferences you can choose whether these values are dropped into a journal file or into a spreadsheet. This was um, previously selected so it would go into Excel. Two channels are labeled ECG and respiration. The cycle number, this is the beginning of the respiration cycle, that's the time there. This was the minimum R to R interval during the inspiration part and this is the maximum R to R interval during the expiration and then the RSA is the difference between the two and um, this is expressed in milliseconds and it's basically it's the maximum rate minus the minimum rate and it's uh, using linear scaling. If you want it in a, a logarithmic scaling you need to convert that manually. So the analysis is relatively quick. Got quite a long data file if I auto scale my waveforms. So this is the ECG channel, the respiration channel and here's my R to R interval. Okay. That concludes this demonstration of the Acknowledge Respiratory Sinus Arrhythmia Analysis.